Everybody, Jason Shadrick here with PremierGuitar.com, and we are at the Winter NAM Show in Anaheim. We're at the Classic Audio Effects booth with Kurt and Kyle, and we are going to look at uh, some uh, some new Classic Audio Effects you brought in. Is this your first time doing NAM Show? Yep. Very first time. First time. Yep. Great. So kind of everything's new here in a way, yep. right? Yep. So tell us what we heard uh, Kyle play there on the intro. Okay, so on the intro, Kyle was playing through our Stump House Overdrive pedal. Um, what it is is it's just a uh, medium game overdrive. What kind of makes our pedals unique is they have a built-in roller. Um, the roller does something different depending on what the pedal is. So we'll start with the Stump House pedal. On the, the, what the roller does on it is actually gain. So all the way back, it's a low gain pedal. As you roll it forward, the gain increases. Nice. So, so where was it in that intro? Where was it in the spectrum? About halfway. About halfway? Yep. Okay. Let's roll all the way down and play it and then all the way back up. And therefore, the switches on top there makes it a little easier. Yep, that's the bypass. And then what are the controls on the side? The side are going to be your tone and your volume. Easy. Yep. Easy All right. Let's move right down now to the transponder. Now, I see you have two different versions of this one. Yep. So for the new stuff that we're launching at NAMM, we're doing two versions. We have a roller version, and we also have a preset version. So for the people that don't want the roller, we have the ability to store five presets per pedal. Okay. And then the transponder, which is our delay, also has tap tempo. So the transponder is a digital delay. The roller controls your delay time, so all the way back it's a long delay. As you roll it forward, you get it, the delay time speeds up, and you can get some cool warping sounds with that as well. So, All right, let's hear a listen to that. And then is that uh, what controls we have on there? Yep, so Mix and feedback, essentially? Mix and repeats, yep. 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 Okay. yep. And then uh, the controls on the top one, the non-roller one, what do the foot switches do? Uh, the foot switches, so the left switch is for your bypass, the right switch is for tap, so you can tap into tempo, and if you tap and hold it, it's going to change your presets. Wonderful. Yep. Cool. So the last one's going to be the Yukon yep. reverb, yep. So what it is, is it's a reverb pedal. So all the way back, it's a small, it's a room style reverb. So all the way back, it's a small room. Yep. As you roll the feet, the roller forward, the room size gets bigger. Um, so you get the longer reflect, reflections off of the walls. All right, let's hear a little bit of that one. Beautiful, and then roll it, and then uh, roll it all the way up or down. Yeah. And you'd like to keep pricing simple on these, right? Yeah. So all of the new ex the uh, effect pedals are one ninety nine, either for the roller or the preset version doesn't matter. So. Yeah. So where can people go online to find out more information about all your pedals, Kurt? Yeah, so all of our pedals are on our website. Um, it's classicaudioeffects.com. And then we're also in a lot of online real, uh, dealers, yep. um, and also in person, like Chicago Music Exchange. So, yep. Well, Kurt, nice thank you so much, you buddy. Too. This is Jason Shadrick with PremierGuitar.com. We're gonna have Kyle play us out. Mm -hmm.